It is the voice of the customer about their experience with an individual employee. So a lot of times that's a frontline employee. Like the pharmacist. Like that pharmacist, right? Yes. Get that pharmacist come around the corner and come out in front of the counter and talk to people and interact with people and build relationship. And, and our, use the term player integration, and we use that around here, but people might not understand what it is. But it's really a frontline employee humanizing uh, the, the survey, the review process, so it comes from that frontline employee. Imagine you go to CVS, you have an interaction with the pharmacist, they do a great job, you, you leave, your phone gets hit or your email gets hit, it says, hey, how was your experience with you know, Janet Stevens over at CVS? Uh, now that we've humanized it, and now I'm writing a review for Janet. Now think about that for big call centers or uh, big companies that have tens of thousands of employees that are out there interacting with customers. Uh, there, there's for a long time, there's not really a way, there hasn't been that middle management tool to measure in real time, to gamify it in real time down to that employee level. But player integration in real time surveys means you can rank all of the employees, you can power the, the individual brand and the company brand of the employees. It, it's a big lift. It's a, it's a change in the way reputation management, people think about it, but it also engages the employee at a whole nother level. So if you think about player integration and you say, okay, is that gamification or behavioral drivers? Uh, let's say it's somewhere in the middle uh, when I survey a customer and they give me great feedback, then I'm having an ego response. I love when people say good things about me. Um, when, uh, when more people are coming in, I might be having a compensatory response. Maybe I'm making more money, right? Uh, when I do a bad job, maybe my boss and my boss's boss know about it instantly. And so that's real accountability that's driving behavior, making me want to do a good job for this customer. And if they're upset, I want to turn that around. And then you could rank me against every other person at my role, and now I'm having a competitive response. I want to win.